They thought it would never happen. Alan Partridge stood on the red carpet addressing the crowds at Anglia Square. Norwich's most famous radio DJ came home today for the world premiere of his film Alpha Papa at Hollywood Cinemas. Um, I'm, I'm proud of Norwich, uh, proud of this film, proud of myself. And how did it feel for Alan to be back in Nelson's County? It feels like sitting in a warm bath um, whilst having a cup of cocoa um, and uh, peanut butter on toast uh, at the side of the bath um, whilst watching um, Air Crash Investigation on a TV. It feels good. Hundreds of people descended on Anglia Square, desperate to catch a glimpse of Partridge on Premier Day. They came wearing costumes, they came holding signs, and they even sang their tributes to the Norfolk icon. And with hundreds of cameras pointed in his direction and dozens of media waiting, Alan revealed the secret to being a successful broadcaster. Um, speak first uh, before you think. Um, it's very important, never stop talking, never leave any dead air. Um, that's the biggest crime of all. It doesn't matter what you're saying or whether you're thinking about anything, always keep talking, that's my biggest tip. It was a proud day for Rob Wilkes and Rafiq Turnbull who masterminded the campaign to bring Partridge home. And it was also a proud day for the cinema's managing director, Trevor Wicks. Yeah, it'll be 25 years next year for Hollywood cinemas. This is probably the highlight at the moment. Um, I couldn't have dreamt for this, to be quite honest. And as you can see, the whole place is alive. Alan described his premiere outfit as a fusion of the styles of Prince Charles and Roger Moore. After a quick venture into the cinema and a few photographs with the fans, he was whisked away for a chopper ride to the London screening. But not before he could say one final goodbye. I'm Alan Partridge. You're watching Mustard TV.